I gotta love Sega so much because they dropped this when I was in class and I thought this would drop at eight o'clock like the first episode, but nope, they dropped this at noon, just like every other thing they drop. <laughs> so weird and like I didn't get home to the afternoon, like one, two o'clock and then like I was doing certain stuff and I took a little power nap and like I had not seen anything about the episode at all. I've been off Twitter for a good while. <laughs> but yeah, until now. Watching episode two drop today. Let's get on to it. Here we go. Alright, so episode two. It's crazy that like we're already in episode two. Three hasn't been feeling like a um week honestly. I mean time's been going by pretty quickly. But yeah. Three weeks until uh, Generation Shops Finding the Way, Episode 2. Alrighty. Up, oh, back to where we are. Maria. Show that freak to stay away from oh! Abe? That's a character from uh, the Gun Soldier from Shadow the Hedgehog. Azri fire up your shadow. Shadow? Are you alright? Maria. Is that Black I'm Doom? Fine. That is Black Doom. It's just the professor created me using alien DNA. Oh. The black arms he called them. The same DNA as this larva. This ugly, heartless creature. I may look like a hedgehog. But I'm really no different than this thing. That's not true. You have a big heart. It may be difficult for you to express it, but I know that deep down, you really do care. About me. About everyone. Looking at the me- <laughs> Looking at the window like that. What you ah. do is what defines you. I know you're having a hard time finding answers, but I'm certain you will one day. All right, Aerith. Then, literally, because the hair alone. Even more people like, she literally looks like Aerith. Oh, here we are. This is, uh... Oh, my. Present day. Looks like, um... Pyramid Cave. Messe 2. Oh, my God. Dude. Dick. Looks so good. Omega? Ain't got Rouge over here. Evening, Didn't expect to see you here. Rouge, what are you doing here? Yeah, I don't vibe with Rouge's voice actor. I can't believe Rouge sounded like that. But anyways, Team Dark is back. Oh my. I have reason to believe the Black Arms have returned. Well, you're out of luck here. This is just a supply depot. Quick reaction right there. Oh my god. Dude, this is so good. Oh my. Man. This is so good. <laughs> Got his wig split. Oh my god. That is crazy. Yo, dude. How do we not have a Sonic anime? But in return, you're going to have to promise to come to Sonic's birthday party. I'll take that as a yes. Now then, interested in raiding a gun base? That's crazy. They literally ended it like that. Wow. They actually did end it like that. That's insane. That was like too short because like the first episode was like um five minutes five and a half minutes but like this is like four and a half minutes which is like i didn't really end it that soon but next we've got um episode three which i'm looking forward to a lot but man what a really dope episode bro this gameplay makes me like more excited to play the game like this is gonna be a fire october because 
I get to play some Sonic Generations and also some Metaphor, which comes out next week, which I'm really excited for. And then, bro, Atlas over here, give me another 100 hour RPG to play, but man, like low key. That's like so interesting they got, um, the um the kid from Shadow the Hedgehog in this is so crazy. Like I never thought. Like I mean, yeah, over here like bringing in like Black Doom and like a lot of the like Shadow the Hedgehog like types like fiend like not fiend but like the type energy that the Shadow game has and like oh except for guns and like swearing which yeah but like it's like so cool like not only was like it was like a, like a great like love letter to like. 2000 sonic fans which like i greatly appreciate because like i mean as someone who like grew up with playing sonic games in the like mid to late 2000s like this just feels like so special love it so much but like dude like it's crazy that like it's nice to see that like shadow <laughs> like shadow's origins that like he was created out of black doom energy which like is very surprising like literally like we never like really knew like who created Shadow until like now like we used to call it, he like created from like Black Doom energy which is like really really interesting and then like <laughs> Eric over here <laughs> Shadow and then like I have a feeling something's up with that freaking uh, soldier <laughs> I play Shadow Hedgehog I I honestly forgot everything about that game personally. Or in the fact that like swearing and guns and like that game literally sucks so much. That game is literally bad. But like that's so cool. We have freaking like it's like a mixture between like the more I see it, it's like a mixture between uh like three D and like two D animation. I found out that the um this um blender they also worked on the knuckle show. <laughs> They also did this too, which is actually pretty impressive. Like literally, like this alone is better than like Sonic Prime season three, which was horrible, and then Knuckle Show, which I mean, it was decent, but like it's literally like as a Sonic show is like very very disappointing. <laughs> literally, like this is like, bro, like give us a Sonic anime. Like, how do you not have this at all? Like, how does like. 10 episodes, I'll definitely, like, watch this, like, have the same, like, studio behind this, too. Or at least have the one that did the Frontiers, uh, prologue. Like, that would be amazing. Like, have, I need to see more of this. Like, more of this. It's so good. Please. Like, it's so clean. Look at, like, the freaking, like, fight scenes, too. Like, it's so insane. Reason to believe the Black Arms have returned. Well, you're out of luck here. This is just... But yeah, like Team Dark is back, bro. Like this is giving me like 06 vibes a lot, cause like obviously you have Methodist there too, but this just feels so much like 06. It's so good. Like we are so back with Sonic. Literally the best like the series has been in a long time. We're really looking forward to uh what this game has to offer. But bro, dude, it's so so good. Like look at this. Hold up, go from the beginning. Look at this. Omega over here, shooting the robot's leg, and then, yeah, like, literally, Rouge over here slicing the arm, and then Shadow over here giving, like, the all-out attack. That's, like, so... And also another thing, too, I don't really vibe, like, I do not vibe with Rouge's, uh, new voice actor. I do not vibe with it. <laughs> like, she sounds more like Amy. Then Rouge, just, I just don't, I do not vibe with it, honestly. Like, like, without due respect, I mean, obviously, like, she's doing a, like, her best, but, like, like, Rouge is a new voice actor, like, does not fit Rouge. I'm sorry, like, literally. I know, like, a lot of people have the same thing, too, but, like, it's just, like, without due respect, like, this Rouge voice actor is, like, not good. Not a perfect fit for Rouge at all. But, anyways, what do y'all think of the episode two did you like it did you really enjoy it and stay tuned for episode three when that drops posting your reaction on that too but anyways thank y'all watching this video like comment subscribe and i'll catch y'all later peace